Hello everyone, Shroom Raver here. And today it is Thursday and you know what that means, it's time for Themed Thursdays. Yes indeed. Now, uh, today it is week 26 and we are going to be continuing on from last week's theme. Last week, um, I used six uh, team mascots from the PPL, the Pokemon Premier League. Uh, that is the uh, sort of semi-competitive fun time league uh, that I'm in with uh, 11 other people. Uh, links will be in the description for that, you can find out all the things you need to know about it and through, by extension find out who's involved. Uh, alternatively, you can watch last week's episode where as I say I used six of the uh, team mascots and this week as a continuation I am using the other six because you know it's nice to let everyone have a go. Uh, however, thing about most of the rest of the mascots is they are sort of little cup Pokemon. So we're going into Little Cup. It's been a very long time since I've been here and I have not tested this team. I am basically going in dry. Pause. But I do have my tea. To make it all better. Now, let us get on with the team that we are going to be bringing. So, looking at the team, first up we have Esper. Uh, Don Fanatic's team is the Tottenham Hot Esper. And we thought a Choice Scarf set. This was originally a uh, Life Orb sub because I'm a man and I do what I want. Um, but that's a bad idea. Life Orb Sub is not a good idea at all. So we've gone with the Scarf set. Why? Yeah, why not? Psychic, Dark Pulse, Energy Ball and Hidden Power Fighting. Um, I don't know how good that coverage is going to be, as I say, I haven't tested this team. But we're going to find out. Then we have Dino, yes, Celta Dino. Uh, choice Band Hustle, because Overkill is fun. <laughs> um, so it's going to be interesting. We've got Outrage, Crunch, Head Smash and Super Power. <laughs> because I love power. Um, if this cell t if this uh, Dino hits a move, uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be power. So, so we've got Dino after uh, Alex Wansey Bayonet's Celta Dino, and we have Teddy Ursa, of course, Ellie's team, the Teddington Teddy Ursas. Got a Toxic Orb Quick Feet set here uh, with Facade, Close Combat, Player Off, and Swords Dance. Teddy Ursa, unlike its evolution, does not get access to Guts. I don't think. No, it doesn't. It gets access to two completely useless abilities in Pick Up and the Mighty Honey Gather. Um, so we've gone with a quick feet set and a sword stance to up that attack. It's always on a timer, but hopefully we can get some big hits off in the meantime. Then we have the second part of our hustle core. This is the mighty Combi. Yes, we've got Combi here. We're Combi Wanderers. Um, Troy, the Trojan Horses team. So we've got a Focus Sash Combi. I don't know how well this thing is going to do. It's got hustle to power up that powerful bug bite. We've also got Endeavor, Tailwind, and Sweet Scent. <laughs> In my mind, I'm thinking that I'm going to set up a Tailwind, use a Sweet Scent to negate the Hustle accuracy drop, and then go for these powerful Bug Bites, get down to my Sash and use Endeavor. If it works, then I don't even know. If Combi manages to do that once, I'm going to guarantee it thumbnail. That's just a thing. <laughs> so then we've got Timber. Yes, the Portland Timbers are the uh, rebranded uh, Orlando City Cabalions. Uh, that's been taken over by RTK, who I'm yet to get to know properly, but I do hope to in the future. He seems like a cool guy, um, very highly spoken of by, by the people who know him, and I'm looking forward to getting to knowing him as a new member of the PPL. Uh, so we've got his mascot here, Timber. This is probably the only like good set that I'm using, the only proper little cup set, as I would say. So we've got Timber here with the Avialite, uh, Guts, Drain Punch, Mac Punch, Knockoff, and Bulk Up. Very much a standard Gerda set. And, uh, yeah, you know, Gerda does work. Let's see if Timber can. And finally, we have Paris. And I know, I know my team is the Parasect, Jermaine, but Parasect is too useless to be used in OU. I had to use Trevenant because it's a better Grass type. And, you know, it's nice to give everyone a chance, and Paras is only as good as Parasect is ever going to be anyway. They're both pretty useless. I could have chosen any of the three Mushroom Pokemon as my mascot, my channel mascot. I could have chosen Amoongus, I could have chosen fucking Breloom, but I went with fucking Parasect, and now it's kind of stuck. Anyway, we've got a sort of specially defensive set here, Giga Drain, Leech Seed, Spore, and Sub. We'll see how it does. <laughs> I don't have massive confidence in this team. But um, we're going to get into some battles, maybe one or two, uh, probably two, because little cut battles don't take too long. Certainly not with this team, they won't. Uh, but anyway, let's just get into some battles and see how they do. Okay, we have Scotty08, to whom we shall say, have fun. He has a much more serious team than mine. <laughs> He's got some premier threats. 
Um, I don't see this game going so well. I mean, Abra's power, Apom's power, Dratini sets up. I've seen Deerling do work. Cranidos is a monster. I don't know what Ekans is going to do, but we'll see, I guess. Um, I could leave him a Scarfa. I think I'm actually going to... Oh, do I want to leave him coming me? Oh, I don't even know. I don't know what to do. Tempted to go with Dino, but it's going to be one of these two leading, I guess. Should I go with Kobe? He could fake out. I'll go with Teliursa. Why the hell not? I get quick feet after I, the Toxic Orb activates, so, you know, we'll see how it does. Hmm. Got my T on my left this time. Usually it's over here, on my right, but <clears throat> got to reach through. And I find I keep hitting my mic and it makes noises. So, here's the Teddy Ursa. There is the Dealing. Dealing gets Jump Kick, and that is not something I'm an enormous fan of. Not at all. Combi would have been a very nice lead. <laughs> um, <laughs> weird as that is to suggest... Do I go into Timber? I could go into Paris. There's nothing I can do to deal with Paris. <laughs> this is so bad. Um, let's go into Timber. <laughs> let's just do it. Bite the bullet, go into Timber and hope to take a hit. Oh, he's an agility set. Well, that's okay. Hmm, I think. Shall I drain punch? Let's drain punch. He's probably adamant, since he's got agility. He's going to go straight into Ekans for that. That, um, that intimidate. I don't fear too much, this thing. He said, Yoda-like. Hmm. Fear this thing too much, I do not. Yes. Uh, he's going to toxic. I mean, I have guts. So, so that's a thing. He is faster. Um, there's a part of me that wants to go into Dano, you know. There really, really is a part of me that wants to go into Dano. Do I do it? What he's gonna go for? By great, let's go to Dano. I mean, I now have guts activated on Timber, so there's that. Uh, we can be happy about that. He goes for the gunk shah ow, no, not a fan. I'm not a fan of that at all. How dare you do that? <laughs> oh my. Um Do I do it? Am I real? I'm real. I'ma go into my boy. My boy Wickham. Gonna go for that big old tailwind. I have 17 speed. Not even bad. Nice and tailwind. Gunk shot. Down to me, Sash. Now let's go for that powerful bug bite. This <laughs> I don't even think this is going to take it out. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Combi. You've got this. <laughs> oh, I hope it works. Come on, Combi. You can do it. I believe. I believe in the power of Do you believe in the power of Combi? Oh dear, I don't know. I like to think Combi can do this. Stay in with Ekans. You have nothing to fear from a Combi. What could Combi do? Go into Dealing? <laughs> Why would he go into Dealing? Yes, Combi! Yes, Combi! <laughs> Not even bad. Don't go into Apom. Don't go into... Don't go into Apom. Oh, he's going to go for the fake out. I know he's going to go for the fake out. I'm saving Combi. Bugger it. Combi just got a kill, by the way. I will take it. <laughs> Let's go into Tedding Teddington. Take the fake out. Get that quick feet. Nice. Nice and quick feet. And go for the close combat. Go on. Go into Craney Dose. You can take a hit, Craney Dose. <laughs> nice and Apom. Hmm. So, he could go into the potential Scarfed Abra. 
That's a thing he could do. Um, there's the cranny dose. That's potentially scarfed as well. But I do have quick feet. I don't outspeed it naturally, though, do I? I think it's going to be Scarf Cranido, Sash Abra. Let's go to Timber. Timber! Okay, that's not so bad. I can deal. I can deal. Um, Hesper's doing 41. I have 50. I sp do I go for knockoff? I think I go for Drain Punch. If you switch it in the Abra, that could be a problem. Um... Ah, Drain Punch, why ever not? Ah, there's the Abra. <laughs> oh, Timber is too good. Timber is fantastic. We're going to go for the Mac Punch. That's what we're going to do. Timber could clean up here. Hmm. Nice and dead Abra. Guts Timber putting in a shift, I can tell you. And he doesn't have much left that wants to take this. The Dratini may be. I'm just going to go for Drain. No reason not to. Thank God I had something legit in this match. <laughs> nice and Timber Dragon Dot. I don't think so, mate. Oh, that takes it, actually. That's somewhat unfortunate. Can I take an outrage? I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can. But I do outspeed him. At plus, I, my 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 uh, my scarfer does outspeed him. So you know, there's that. So oh, I should have probably. What happened? Oh, he used Aquajet and I took him out. Oh, sorry. I was trying to cancel that move, and I think I accidentally clicked um, skip turn. So what happened there was he used Aquajet. And I used Drain Punch and killed him. So now we've got this Cranidose. I'm just going to go for Mac Punch. Cranidose is frail, and I suspect this thing is scarfed. Doubt that crit matters. If I'm if I'm being honest, I doubt that crit matters. Dealing. Dealing is his last mon, and I'm going to go for Drain Punch. We know this thing is not scarfed. He might outspeed and kill. That's fine. If that happens. Um, Ah, oh, expecting me to go for the, for the uh, for the one move. I'm gonna say GG, um, and I get some points. So that's nice. He was clearly expecting the Mac Punch, which is fine. Um, so Timber, sort of doing work um, as I would expect it to, as the only sort of legitimate member of this team. Uh, let's find another game. Okay, we have Mini Jim, to whom you should say have fun. Nothing the same on his team as with the previous team, but. Similar to the previous team, he has threats. Everything on his team is either a threat or a bastard. Threat, threat, bastard, bastard, threat, bastard. Is essentially what we're working with here. The mean Fu lead is, is painfully obvious. The mean Fu lead is painfully obvious. I'm tempted to go to Paris. Paris, I realise, can't do a damn thing to any grass type at all, ever. So, so Paris, as as per usual, is useless. Um, I mean, I mm, let's go with Esper. <clears throat> it's the Ferrisseed. I'm really kind of wishing that I packed Hidden Power Fire, which I was going to do at one point. I was going to pack Hidden Power Fire. Let's go with the HP fighting. Let's see how much this does. It's not going to do much. Oh, I get a nice crit. I will take it. There's the rocks. They don't help my, um... They don't help my combi one bit. <laughs> they don't help my combi one bit. Um... They don't help a lot of my team. If we're being honest. I'm going to go for Hidden Power Fire. Hidden Power Fire. Hidden Power Fighting. Again. Which really only hits his Pawniard. Everything else is... Well, this guy takes it neutrally. Mean Fu. 
everything else just eats it up. He realizes by now it's hidden power fighting. Here's the Fungus. Uh, let's go into Paris. I think just to kind of scout and see what this Fungus is working with. So Paras gonna take the spore like a champion. Um, now we'll see if he has the uh, that sludge bomb. Is it time to go into Dano? Is that is that what's happening here? Oh, I think it might be. Let's pull the double into Dano. Is he real? Does he go for the double spore? Him power fire. Not today, my friend. Should I lock myself in on outrage? Let's do it. Banded hustle outrage. Come on, Dano. Do not let me down. Don't do it. Don't you dare. Don't you even think about it. <laughs> nice and dead. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> oh, I'm not even mad that I'm now going to be revenged so easily by this ghastly. What's he going to do? Is he going to go for the dazzling gleam? He misses a hypnosis. <laughs> Dano! Dano, come through. <laughs> oh, my lord. Thank you, based Dano. Okay. Um. Wow, right. Here's the Pawniards. I don't really want to stay in. Um, <laughs> I'm tempted to anyway. I mean, Timber can do work from here. What's he going for? Let's go into Combi. There goes my T. Foul play? <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Um... I have HP fighting on this Esper, but he will have the um the thingy what's it. You know what I mean. Right? The 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 the, the dark type move stab thing, the sucker punch, that's the one. Timber, I guess. I think that seems to be the way to go. And now do I want to pull a double into Slowpoke? He can't touch me, he's got to switch out. I'll go for knockoff. Predicting the uh, the slow poke. I mean, if he stays in, I'm just going to go for a Mac punch anyway. So <laughs> I don't think he's staying in. I think he's going into slow poke. He's got to go into slow poke. I'm tempted to pull the double into Teddy Ursa. Oh, it's the Mean Fu, and I knock off leftovers. Leftovers on a little cup Pokemon. Okay. Now we're going to Paras, mainly to sack him. My mascot not really doing too much. Uh, there's the drain punch. I think it's resisted. I mean, there's that. Um. I'll go for Giga. He can easily go into Ferrisseed, and that would be absolutely fine. You turn that's okay, I get initiative. So I'm glad I didn't pull any kind of switch. <laughs> and what's he go into? I'm loath to go into timber and just kind of clean up. Cause that's what I did last time. <laughs> I kinda wanna use all the things. It's the pornia though. Hmm. Going to Dano. I could. I could, but I won't. I'm going to go to Timber. You know. Why not? He's seen the knockoff. I don't know if he wants to go for it again. I'll go for the Drain Punch. If he wants to stay in, then so be it. If he wants to go out into something, that's also fine. He goes into the mean food. This is not going to take it favourably. Does, of course, have that regenerator.
Um, I'm just gonna go for a drain punch. You know, this is in a violet timber. The mean foo is gonna go for its own drain punch. I win this matchup because that does a lot, and now I'm just gonna go for a mac punch, which I think should take it out. I mean, that did. Yeah, let's go for the mac punch. Let's make it happen. And try and take out this mean foo. Rather hoping it does, otherwise I'm going to look like a tit. Um, it does. Mean Fu is down. I repeat, Mean Fu is down. Um, here's the Pawniard. I mean... <laughs> I don't know. Do I want to go to S? I mean... I don't know why he'd bring this in. I'm gonna Mac Punch. I'm just going to. And that's a dead Pawniard. Timber is very good <laughs> in this kind of thing. You know, we all know how powerful Gerda is and Conk is just a monster. But it turns out Timber works just as well down here in Little Cop. Um. I'm going to go into Teddy Ursa, try and tank a hit, and go for some kind of attack. Teddy Ursa did, uh, did get a KO in the last game, but now I get the Toxic Orb, and now we just go for Facades, and kind of do massive damage to everything. So unfortunately, poor old Esper, um, Esper echoing their team uh, in the PPL, not doing much. I'm sorry, Jack. That was a that was a cheap shot. Gonna get a nice facade off on the slowpoke and go down to um, the old uh, what's it called? Uh, poison. Let's go into Esper. Come on, come on, Esper. Make it happen. Gonna go for that dark pulse, which I'm hoping will two it care of the Pharisee if he wants to switch it in. Slowpoke doesn't really have a chance. I've got a Dano and I've got a knockoff Timber with a Violite, so. I think we've basically got this wrapped up, I would like to think. So, what does our friend Mini Jim want to do here? He's gonna let the Slowpoke go down, so Esper doing something in the end. I mean, I mock, but Paras has done absolutely fuck all this game. <laughs> Let's go for that Dark Pulse. Try and take out this Ferrisseed. Um It's a two-hit KO from there. He's going to miss a Leech Seed, which is just unfortunate. <laughs> He's also packing leftovers. If Violet's a thing, Mini Jim, and if you've got Leech Seed, you don't need leftovers. But there's 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 a good game. So good game, Mini Jim. A nice another win for us. And yeah, that's two for two. Um, as we rocket up the ladder to 1,083 points. Um, and yeah, that is going to be it. I mean, that's two games. Uh, and I think that's going to be it from this episode of Theme Thursday. So, thank you very much for watching, as our friend Mini Jim does indeed say GG. I do hope you enjoyed. Uh, we took out two pretty threatening teams. Let's take a look at the team that we used. Um, you know, Esper putting work at the end. Fucking Dano in the second game just destroyed lives. Teddy Ursa putting a bit of a shift. Combi did something in the first game at least. It got a kill, so there's that. I mean, Timber was the MVP by a long way. By just a street. I mean, Dano did a lot of work. Props to Dano, but Timber, I think, really has to take the uh, thumbnail position this week. And Paras, as I expected, did fuck all. <laughs> so, as I say, that's going to be it from this episode of Themed Thursdays. Um, remember, if you have a theme that you want me to use in Themed Thursdays, uh, write it down in the comment section, down there, down below. Or hit me up on Twitter, you can always do that. And give me your themes, because remember, you suggest the theme, I'll bring the team. That is how it works. This was the second episode of uh, Theme Thursdays based around the PPL. PPL links will be in the description below. Go, do go and check out the uh, YouTube channel and the Twitter uh, for all things PPL. All the information you need will be there. Uh, this, as you're watching it, will be up on Thursday. Later on today, as it is, it's actually Wednesday that I'm recording, but it will be Thursday when you're watching this, I imagine. In a few hours, I'll be taking on Slyro and the Pittsburgh Pyrals in my uh, 
in my next PPL match, in the fifth match. Um, I'm really nervous about it already. Uh, that will probably be going up on Monday. Uh, on Friday, I'm going off to Wales to see some friends. I'll be back sometime on Monday, and that is when my next upload will be. So that's when the next uh, PPL match will be up. Until then, as you know, just uh, keep on sending me those team suggestions. Uh, but that is, as I say, going to be it from me. I've rambled on for long enough. So thank you once again for watching. And I guess, until next time, laters.